Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Edinburgh Jazz and Blues Festival. Please welcome to the TV at Row stage, Ali Affleck and the Gin Mill Genies with a homage to Billie Holiday. Hello, everybody. Thank you for coming. So we've got a, a little selection of songs here. Some of them you'll know, some of them you might not know, unless you're diehard fans. And I'll try and keep my chat minimal because if you've ever seen me perform before, you'll know that I can talk a hell of a lot. <laughs> and it's not always very sane. <laughs> We're starting off with a beautiful love song that is actually quite dirty. If you think about what she's saying. She's got a line where she says, if you mean that look I've seen, say it with a kiss. So it's a bit about carnal desire. Let me hear you say it, say it with the kiss. For your eyes might speak a book, and my eyes might miss. There is wine and candles shine, and music in those lips. Music in the touching of your fingers. Say, words may not convey it, say it with a kiss. If you mean that look I've seen, say it with a kiss. You don't have to know the words to love's familiar tune. Say it with a kiss and say it.
Thank you so much. So, I'm sure you recognize a lot of these lovely gentlemen on the stage with me. I will introduce them as we go along. But before we get there, we're going to do a lovely, lovely song that Billie Holiday sang when she was about 21, and it was featured in a film, just a very small cameo in a film, but for the life of me, I can't remember the film. So, um, if anybody remembers, come and tell me later. It's called, I Must Have That Man. Don't want my mammy, I don't need a friend My heart is broken, it won't ever mend I ain't much caring on where I will end I must have that man I'm like another that's crying for he he treats me awful each time that we meet It's just unlawful how that boy can cheat But I must have that man His heart is Hades A lady's not safe in his eyes When she's kissed but I'm afraid that he's cooled off And maybe I'm ruled off his lips I need that person much worse than just bad I'm half alive and he's driving me mad He's only human if he's to be had But I must so much that's an interesting song the lyrics I find very interesting because she obviously doesn't like this guy but she does like him so she's completely conflicted and I particularly like the line his heart is Hades isn't that fabulous and a woman's not safe so she's basically talking about how awful this guy is and then but she wants him so it's the bad boy attraction nonsense again which of course Billy Holiday was very famously involved in um, Carmen McRae, who was a very close friend of hers, said that if there was one asshole in a sea of hundreds, she would go straight to that one. <laughs> We're going to be doing a song that Carmen McRae wrote for Billie Holiday a little bit later. I've kind of put in a few songs in here that I've been researching quite a lot, songs that Billie Holiday herself loved, that she considered her songs. And also her bandmates like Lester Young and whatnot, the songs that they particularly loved that she sang. And they're not the ones that you might think. In fact, 
we're going to do one of them that you may not know, but Lester Young said it was his favorite. But we're getting to them a little bit later. Before we do, we're going to do a bit of a silly song, because these are the fun ones. And this is an early song for her. Tin Pan Alley, so ridiculous lyrics, but actually very, very sweet lyrics. This is called A Sunbonnet Blue and a Little Straw Hat. to say I do So they rode to June and glory On a bicycle made for two Years have passed The song is old Summer days are true With silver strands among the gold She still says I love you A somebody blue and a yellow straw hat Are true to this very day For he loves her in December as he did in May Thank you so much. So I, I selected that song because I think the lyrics are adorable. I love the line where it says, the silver threads among the gold. They still say, I love you. I think it's lovely. And he loved her, he loves her in December as he did in May. So Tin Pan Alley, a lot of it was just ridiculous, but they knew how to put a, a cute little tune together. And these were songs that Billy sang in the early days of her career. Uh, as was this next one. This was one that she loved to sing. She loved it. She used to sing it very slow. I, I prefer to sing it fast because to me, the lyrics again are um, suggesting that you know, she's broken up with this guy or whatever and instead of crying about it, she's actually like, screw you. <laughs> You'll see what I mean. I think it's fabulous. I cried for you, it's called. Run, 
one thing you're learning yeah. I cried for you What a fool I used to be But now I found to hide Little bit through I found a heart just a little bit too I cried for you Thank you so much. I like that one a lot. I normally like to sing that one after a really sad one because it kind of takes you back around full circle. And now we're um, at the point of the, the song that Lester Young loved to hear Billy sing. And it's not so well known, and it is a, another one of these Tin Pan Alley songs. But again, it has some really gorgeous, gorgeous lyrics in it. It's called, It's Like Reaching for the Moon. It's like reaching for the sun It's like reaching for the stars It's like reaching for the moon Reaching for you You're so high above me How can I expect an angel to love? So divine as you are It's like flying without wings Laying fiddle without strings Or 
for a million of the things no one can do. Though my hopes are slender, in my secret heart I pray you will surrender soon. It's like reaching for the moon. It's like flying without wings Playing fiddle without strings And a million other things No one can do Though my hopes are slain in my secret heart, I pray you will surrender soon. No, it's like reaching for the moon. Thank you so much. Isn't that lovely? Playing fiddle without strings. Isn't that just gorgeous? What happened to all that beautiful writing? If you turn on the radio now and it's just, I'm not even going to go there. You know what I'm talking about. We're going to do um, a song that Billie Holiday wrote herself. She wrote three and sort of co-wrote on one. Um, but this one is, is a particularly interesting one. It's called Lady Sings the Blues. Remember, we're starting with a three-section steel. All good? 
Oh, also, they always say she's a blues singer. She, wasn't, she only sang like three blues in her entire career. So I find this is funny, but this is one of them. Those blues is all about Lady sings the blues She tells her side Nothing to hide Now the world will know What her blues is all about Well Blues ain't nothing but a pain in your heart When you had a bad start You and your man had to part But I ain't gonna sit around and cry And I know I won't die Cause I love him Lady sings the blues She's got a bad She ain't gonna say them no more When you had a bad start, you and your man had a fire. But I ain't gonna sit around and cry, and I know I won't die, cause I love him. Lady sings the blues, she's got a baby. Sing 
introduce these guys that you're listening to and it's always such an immense pleasure that they say yes when I ask them to perform gigs. We'll start in the far corner. <laughs> gotcha. Mr. Jim Drummond on the drums. <laughs> Where's your hat today, Jim? Jim normally wears a little hat, which is really groovy, but it is, it is awfully warm up here. And in the front line here, we've got Mr. Colin Steele on the trumpet. Martin Kershaw on two different saxophones. Andy Sharkey on the double bass. Fiddle without strings. <laughs> it's a big fiddle. And of course, Mr. Steve Hamilton on the old Joanna piano. I am trying not to rant too much because you know what was going through my mind just then was I was thinking how much cat hair is on my dress. I have a cat, as most jazz people do. I know Colin has cats and Steve has cats and Dexter decided I, to lay on my dress before I came out. Of course, they have to do that as much as I explain that fur is not a nice fashion accessory in 2019. That's one of my fears. There'll be more. If you can see it, tough. I've got a kitty and he, I, I live for my kitty. <laughs> it's quite ridiculous. Um, I digress, as I often do. We're going to do a wonderfully fun song next. Um, again, this is a, another Tin Pan, Pan Alley job. It's a joyous song. I, there's such a huge repertoire for Billie Holiday. It's very, very hard to, to pick any songs at all. But I tend to enjoy her happy songs more. Because you know what? Uh, you know, from all accounts, everybody who knew her said she was not a tragic figure. She wasn't. She partied hard. And in the words of, um, it, wasn't, it wasn't Lester Young, it, the name will come back to me, but one of her bandmates said, oh, she had an appetite for everything, for drink, men, women, partying, and then later, unfortunately, the drugs, and that's, that was the, the slippery slope that got her in the end. But she was, in their account, like one of the lads, you know, she didn't sleep very much, she was always up gambling with them, drinking booze and making filthy jokes. And they said she was upbeat and happy pretty much all the time. So I think it's important to focus on the positives. And this one is one of the most positive songs. It's called I Hear Music. One, two, one, two, three, four. Blowing out the breezes in the air Red love the mailman on the stair Sure that's music, mighty fine music Singing of a sparrow in the sky Working out the coffee right nearby But my favorite melody well, That's my baby phoning me Get me out of bed and sing this song
Blowing off the breezes in the air The red light, the mailman on the stair Sure, that's music Mighty fine music Singing off a sparrow in the sky Working on the coffee right nearby But my favorite melody well, There's my baby phone and me I hear music Mighty fine music And anytime I think my world is wrong I'll get me out of bed Thank you so much. Speaking of sparrows, I had a little guy landing up on my window ledge, which Dexter, my cat, thought was fantastic. Tiny little guy. I've got a lovely courtyard, and it's great because all the, the birds come because somebody feeds them a lot. The little squirrel has her babies there every year because someone feeds them a lot. <laughs> it's great fun, and it's good for Dexter as well. So everybody happy. We're going to do... A really fabulous song next, um, and it's quite a new one for me. Uh, I mentioned Carmen McRae earlier. She was a very good friend of Billie Holiday's, and she said, uh, so Billie Holiday's birthday was two days before her, and they used to have massive parties. Like, just everything was going on. And Carmen McRae said, so we'd go out and celebrate Lady's birthday. But by the time my birthday came around, I was in bed. I couldn't get out. I was completely done. She goes, that's how hard Lady used to party. This is a lovely song that Carmen wrote and Billy performed called Dream of Life. was empty when you went away Even the blue skies above had turned gray But now that you've come back My dream of life is here to stay Those little quarrels that tore us apart Oh, gee, I can see they were wrong from the start. But now that you've come back, my dream of life is here to stay. I can't seem to see just what you see in me. I guess love is really blind. This world seems so great now that you understand It's you I adore, it's you I live for Life is sublime now that you're here with me Please keep it in mind, dear, and don't stray from me For now that you've come back, my dream of life is here to stay Sublime now that you're here with me 
please keep it in mind, dear, and don't stray from me. For now that you've come back, my dream of life is here to stay. Thank you very much. I think that's becoming one of my new favorites, actually. It's a very interesting song with some nice lyrics in it as well. Um, we're going to shift to a song that I particularly enjoy for, for several reasons. It was in the film Stormy Weather, um, one of the songs that uh, Billy sang as the character Indy. And she's talking about Storyville. And if any of you have seen me before or come to other shows, you'll know that I've got a major obsession with the very, very early jazz and blues. And Storyville is a big part of it. And um, I'm working on a project related to that right now. And this is a song that addresses Storyville. It's called Farewell to Storyville. Now, there is a part that if you want to sing along, you're more than welcome. Otherwise, you're just going to have Colin on the back and vocal. Which is fine too. We need as, I mean, as much help as we yeah. can get. Yeah. yeah. It's very simple. So when I get to the, the midsection, I'm going to sing, um, pick out a steamboat, pick yourself a train. And then you'll go, a slow train. And I say that twice. And then um, I'll close that section with saying, they make you close up, they'll never take you back. And then you'll go, won't let you back. Colin can help you. <laughs> <laughs> and then the second time round, we're gonna, I'm going to say the blue skies follow rain, so you'll go the cold rain. And then the last line that you'll enjoy singing, I should have given you all song sheets, is um, I'll say, just say farewell, get your one last thrill. And the final line is, your one last thrill. You might remember it, you might not, but even if you don't, hum along, it's a great fun song. In the movie, if you've all seen it, everybody is singing along with her, so it's a fun tune. Farewell to Storyville. All you old time queens from New Orleans who lived in Storyville, you sang the blues, tried to muse. Here's how they pay the bill. The law stepped in and called it sin. To have a little fun The police car has made us stop Storyville is done Pick out your steamboat Pick yourself a train A slow train Pick out your steamboat, pick yourself a train, a slow train. They made you close up, they'll never let you back, won't let you back. Go buy your ticket, or else you'll walk the train. Pick out your steamboat, pick yourself 
off the train A slow train Pick out your steamboat Pick yourself a train A slow train They make you close out They'll never let you back Won't let you Go buy your ticket Or else you walk the train Well, no use complaining Blue sky follow rain The cold rain No use complaining Blue skies follow The cold, cold rain Just say farewell now Get your one last thrill Your one last thrill Just say farewell now Farewell to Storyville Thank you. Of course, the great Louis Armstrong was on cornet. I think he was on cornet. Was he in cornet or trumpet in that one? In, in, uh, in the film Stormy. If you've not seen it, you must see it. It's just basically an excuse to get all the best jazz musicians of the time in one, in one picture, really, it seems like. It's great fun. Fat Swaller has a cameo in it, too, which is fabulous. So we're going to um, switch the mood yet again, with a, oh, I almost gave us the wrong song there. We're going to do a love song next, and then we're going to do a creepy love song. So we're going to do sweet love, and then we're going to do freaky love. Um, but actually, this next song, is there anybody here from the USA? Are you from Alabama? Is anyone here from Alabama? One person? No? Well, okay, then I can talk. <laughs> I've been to Alabama, okay. Now, this is painting a beautiful romantic picture of Alabama, which I find to be a little ironic. Make up your own minds. It's called Stars Fell on Alabama. <laughs> it's not romantic there at all. And 
stars fell on Alabama last to go ahead and do the creepy love song that I mentioned to you before. <laughs> it really is. It's a fantastic song. Um, it's called You're Gonna See a Lot of Me. And she ain't joking. <laughs> I'm gonna put it these here just now. I'm gonna get you, I'm gonna get you I'll make you love me, wait and see Day and night and night and day You're gonna see a lot of me I'm gonna haunt you, I'm gonna haunt you Oh, what a pest I'm gonna be Day and night, night and day You'll see a lot of me I'll be 
the spoon in your coffee, the knife that cut is your brain. If I seem a little bit off, well, that's because, because, because you go to my head. If you're in China, I'll go to China. I will never let you be. Cause day and night, and night and day, you'll see a lot of me. I'm gonna haunt you, I'll make you want me, wait and see, day and night and night and day, you'll see a lot of me, I'm gonna haunt you, I'm gonna haunt you, what a pest I'm gonna be. If I seem a little bit off it, that's because, because, because you go to my head. If you're in China, I'll go to China. I will never let you be. Day and night, and night and day, you'll see a lot of me. so much. <laughs> Isn't that fun? Have any of you heard that one before? Ooh, I like it when I find something new. Yeah. We're going to follow that one with another love song, which is a very, very famous love song. Et voilà. Yeah. I have a habit of changing things. Yeah, this is a very, very iconic Billie Holiday song. Beautifully illustrates um, the sense of being massively in love with someone and how it encompasses everything and everything you see and feel. It's a beautiful, beautiful thing to revisit. If you've, if you've forgotten what that feeling is, try and 
Try and go back there with the song because it's beautiful. Thank you. 
Did you all try and remember how all that felt? Some of you may be in that situation right now, which is always lovely. It's beautiful. It's hard. I think it's very hard for people sometimes to convey emotions in songs or in poems, but I guess that's... Well, we've had many wonderful people, like Lord Byron. That's an old one. Can't think of any modern ones. Who's a modern poet that's wonderful? Don Patterson? Apart from Don Patterson and Lord Byron. We must have more than that, right? <laughs> oh, yeah, what about Rabbi Burns? But he was such a naughty, naughty man. I don't think he really would have waited until the, the rocks turned to... What was it you said? My love is like a red... My love is like a red, red rose. I'd forgotten all the rest of the lyrics, but he didn't mean that for more than five minutes. Naughty man. <laughs> We're going to do another nice... Nice... A nice song with very contradictory lyrics that I'll, I'll maybe mention if I remember after we, we do it. It's called Don't Worry About Me. Yeah. Don't worry about me I'll get along Forget Be happy, my love. Let's say our little show is over, and so the story ends. Why not call it a day? The sensible way, and still. Be friends. Look out for yourself. Should be the rule. Give your heart and your love to whomever you love. Don't be a fool. Darling, why should you cling to some old faded thing that used to be? If you can't forget, don't worry about me. Oh 
Darling, why should you cling to some old faded thing that used to be? If you can forget, don't worry. About me. Thank you so much. So one of the reasons I find that song a little interesting is um. So Frank Sinatra sings that one too, but he sings it in a very Frank Sinatra alpha male kind of way, where he's like, "Don't worry about me." Jim was talking about this earlier. Whereas、um, when, the, when the ladies sing it, I think we sing it slightly differently. I think it's a bit. It's. I find it interesting because some of the lyrics are. They say, "Look out for yourself" should be the rule, but then it says, "Give your heart and your love to whoever you love," and then it says, "Don't be a fool." So to me, I find that all very slightly bizarre, slightly contradictory in my in my eyes. So the way I like to sing it probably approaches a different emotion. I tend to get very attached to the lyrics in the songs that I select. So they're nice little stories that you can inhabit, and I think that's probably you know they're open for interpretation, aren't they? But it's a very very beautiful song. This next one is technically our last song. Technically, <laughs> unless 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 you feel that you can, you know, abuse us enough to stay on the stage, we don't really want to walk on and off. I mean, I've got heels on for starters, so, and I already have my my Nora Batty worry about my. <laughs> there's a, there's an old reference. <laughs> some of you get it, some of you don't. Y'all know Nora Batty. Yeah, these guys these guys are old. That's why. <laughs> Before we start, before we start, <laughs> they don't make it like they used to. <laughs> before we、um, do our final song, this is a, it's a silly little Tin Pan Alley song, but it's fun and it's a bit sexy. But before we get there, I want to again thank these beautiful musicians on the stage with me. This is Jim Drummond on the drums. Trumpet. Martin Kershaw on reeds. Andy Sharkey on the big violin.、And、Steve Hamilton on the piano. This is a lovely song. It's called "Them Their Eyes." Full chorus.、Uh, no, full chorus. Have a really cute way of flirting with those eyes. You know they make me feel so happy. They make me feel blue. Well, I'm falling, no stalling, and in a great big way for you. You started something 'cause my heart is thumping. Those eyes. You better look out, little bold eyes, if you're wise. They sparkle, they bubble. Gonna get you in a whole lot of trouble, baby.
Jim Drummond. Andy Sharkey. First time I looked into those eyes You've got yourself a really cute way of flirting with those eyes They make me feel everything, make me feel sad Well I'm falling, no stalling, in a great big way for you You started something cause my heart is thumping those eyes You better look a little brown eyes if you're wise They smile in a whole lot of trouble, oh baby. Then there I Thank you so much. Look at all these gorgeous guys on the stage. We're going to finish up with one of my all-time favorite Billie Holiday songs. That's why I'm glad you applauded it enough. And it's called Now or Never. And it's, it's pretty groovy. You're going to like it if you've not heard it before. If you have heard it before, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Daddy, make up your mind I've been waiting such a long, long time Now, baby, I'll never Cause I've been so good to you Now, baby, I'll never And I've been so lonesome, too It's either a yes or no It's either you stay or go You gotta commit to yourself You can't leave me on the shelf Either you will, baby You won't fall in love with me Is either a yes or no Is either you stay 
or go. You can't leave me on the shelf. You gotta commit yourself. Either you will, baby, you won't fall in love with me. And of course, the fabulous Ali Affleck on the vocals. Thank you so much, everybody. Thank you so much for coming. And we look forward to seeing you again soon. Enjoy all the rest of the beautiful things on offer. And we'll see you again very soon. Thank you. Bonsoir.